Hey Morphe Babes and sweet people, it's me, Kashmir, Beauty Bakery CEO and founder. I'm so excited to be at Studio Morphe. I wanna tell you a little bit about Beauty Bakery, why I started the brand, how I'm inspired by sweets. I started this brand in 2011 and it started with one great idea and before long it was like brownies lip with flower and I was like wow I can build on this idea and really grow it out and then obviously at that time I'm growing and evolving as a woman and I'm learning a lot about myself and my career path and my health was affected. I was diagnosed with breast cancer at 27. I had to have a double mastectomy with reconstruction where they rebuild your breasts. And during that journey, I learned also the importance of what I'm putting into my body. So I'm really um, focused on how to create the pigments you want and the products you want, but in the healthiest ways possible. I'm really excited to show you guys some of my favorite products. One of my favorite products from the Beauty Bakery line is our Wake and Bake Oil. Number one, it's a fast absorbing oil. So if you put this oil on at night, it's gonna absorb by morning, but your face is going to feel super hydrated and very just soft, like baby skin. I would apply this prior to putting on matte foundations. I'm gonna move into powder now. I'm gonna talk a little bit about what shades I use in this flower setting powder and how I use them. The first one is Cassava. In my opinion, it's for people who have a little bit of a warmer undertone. You can also use this if you have a neutral undertone. So for Cassava, I like to use this to bake my concealer. And then I would go with Plantain, which is a warmer golden color to bake my foundation. And then just wanna to briefly touch on how I use the tools to use these is our blending egg sponges. If you are suffering from dry skin, I've learned that a damp sponge with the flower is probably a better approach. If you have oilier skin, honey, keep this sponge nice and dry and then apply your mattifying powder and you should be able to keep off the oil enemy of the day. And I'm not gonna press it in because I'm about to apply eyeshadow. So for my look, I'm gonna be using the Morphe 39S palette. So I'm going to go ahead and start with this color. All right guys, I am going to get that strong line and soften it up with this shade and that shade. It's a little bit of this and a little bit of that. You know what we do in kitchens, we just mix stuff together. So we're gonna move right on. I'm gonna go in for a little bit of poppage because it's an exciting day. And I'm gonna use this shade and I'm just gonna use my finger for this one. I'm gonna finish this look on this eye. Come back with this eye all ready to go because you know he's probably somewhere waiting on me. And then we can move into the rest of the look. Everyone, I wanna show you guys the lollipop liner. I'm obsessed with our lollipop liner. It's matte black and it does not come off. There we are, I have my liner applied. I'm gonna show you the pigment power of the Lollipop liner. It's sweet, but it's no plaything. Watch. As you guys can see, this is not going anywhere. So I am gonna be using House of Lashes iconic light. What I like about this style is the depth and dimension that it provides for me. So I'm going to put these on and I'll be right back. I'm going to be using iconic London's mascara to, I guess, marry my lashes to our falsies. I'm really obsessed with putting mascara on my bottom lashes. I don't even know how to express the immensity of what I feel for mascara on bottom lashes. It's just, I have no words. Alrighty, so we're gonna get into this cotton candy blush lighter palette. So the reason why I named it a blush lighter palette is because it's almost multifunctional. You can do what you want with this palette, to be honest. It doesn't even have to be just blush and highlighter. I've put this on my eyes before. The shades, depending on how you hold that brush, 
how much product you apply. You can get blush out of this or you can get a really soft, subtle, almost sophisticated highlight. I'm gonna go in with 24 hour champagne diet. All right, so here we are with a little bit of 24 hour champagne diet and sip sip hooray. I have these babies here. This is a slice of cake. Inside of here, you'll get a mini cake pop blippy. These are clutch size. Today, I'm gonna go with one of our top sellers from the cake pop blippy line, which is Skinny Dip. And then I'm gonna top it with Morphe's Gloss Trippy. These two together are so pretty. And trippy. All right, you sweet Morphe babes. This is the look completed. I'm so excited about this look. I can't believe that I can actually wear color and be comfortable with it. I think that if you're insecure at all about using color, go ahead and try with me. We can do this together. I'm so excited to be a part of the Morphe family and I'm really excited to have the Morphe family become a part of the Beauty Bakery family. We look forward to seeing your looks, collaborating, talking, growing, and I'll see you next time. And let's get into this look. I wanted to literally fall off the chair. I will throw my weave. This is new. And I'll see you next time. My feet were down here like... <laughs>